Hey everyone, this is Steve from Publish Press, and if you want to improve your WordPress publishing, you should get the Publish Press plugins. In this video, I'm going to give you an example of one really cool feature you can get with our plugins. If you use the Gutenberg editor, you can add a gallery, but the images will just sit there. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can get your images to appear inside a really nice light box that you can then navigate around using arrows with captions below the images. This is possible with the Publish Press Blocks plugin. Over 30,000 users rely on this plugin to add all sorts of cool extra features to their Gutenberg editor. It's completely free to use. I have Publish Press Blocks installed on this site. You can see it in the left menu there. And I'm gonna make a post with a gallery inside it. So the title will be post with gallery. And if I add a new block, I can search for gallery. This is going to be the default option inside the Gutenberg editor. And I'm going to upload some images of penguins that I've downloaded before. Here they are. They are automatically sorted into a gallery. Gutenberg is a really cool tool like that. I might want to change the number of columns. I have four photos, so putting them in a two column grid might be a pretty good idea. All I need to do now, after adding the images to my gallery, is click publish. And if I view the post on the front end, I will automatically have a gallery in the light box showcasing all the images in a really nice way. If I go back to my post, I can choose the block settings. I can rearrange the images if I want. And I can change the size of the images as well. I can do all the things that I do with the normal gallery block, but thanks to the Publish Press Blocks plugin, I also get a really nice light box view. There we go. I changed the images to full size, and now they're appearing in a significantly larger format than they were the first time we looked at this gallery. If I go to the admin area of my WordPress site and I go to Publish Press Blocks and Configuration, this is a option in the main configuration area. It's enabled by default. If you don't like it, you can disable it. And there's also an image caption option as well. This caption option is also enabled by default and is also really easy to use. When you're looking at your gallery, and if you hover over an image, then you should see a right caption option there. This is penguin standing. This one is group of penguins. This is penguin walking. And this one is two penguins. There we go. The captions are appearing over the top of each of these. And when you load them, they appear in the bottom left corner. So as soon as you install Publish Press Blocks, you get this really nice extra feature, which improves the basic settings in the Gutenberg editor. Publish Press Blocks has dozens of these extra features, lots of useful settings, lots of useful blocks, Join 30,000 other users and give Publish Press Blocks a try today. It's completely free to use and to download from WordPress.org.